Good morning. How are we doing today? Okay, okay. Well, it's for you. We're having coffee this morning. You know, this happened last week, didn't it? This is my uh, day off from work, my self-care day. And I was once again wide awake at 4 o'clock in the morning. So I thought, hey, may as well come back down to the water, have some coffee, and yeah. So remember at some point today to get up, stretch a little bit, drink some water, take your meds if that applies to you, eat something if you can, keep the bugs off of you. (laughs) And I hope that you remember that you are loved, you matter. I'm so glad you're here with me. And I hope that you have an awesome day. Love you guys. So we have three appointments today, but for now, let's just, uh, let's enjoy the view. Look that way. While I'm not a fan of insomnia, I must say, coming down to the water first thing in the morning, it is a great way to start the day. I meant to show you, I added uh, <laughs> backpack straps made out of belts. It's, uh, it's not perfect. It's my first time ever trying to rivet something, but it works. So the whole idea is uh, post-apocalyptic. I needed a backpack, so I made it out of stuff in the garbage. That's the vibe. Anyway, we'll see how it goes actually using it today. So I ended up having pretty much zero footage of me being at the coffee shop having second breakfast because my phone tipped over and the whole idea was to show the whole thing from one vantage point today because I thought that would be cool for some reason. Anyway, second breakfast was great and I did some video editing and I worked on another um, checklist. So remember how I have the tag on my work bag to make sure that I bring everything I need for work? Well, I realized on my days off because I'm out of the house for most of the day going to different appointments because it doesn't make any sense to go all the way home when I have an hour between appointments. And so I made a tag, here I'll show you, for my backpack. And this is the backpack that I take with me when I have my days off, especially on my appointment days, to make sure that I bring the things that I need. Now, not everything fits in the bag, but it's making sure that I have everything that I need before I leave the house. I'll probably do a what's in my backpack video at some point. the book I picked up. It looked really good, and I thought maybe we could start reading through this when we have tea in the morning.
Oh, hey. So, that concludes a day of medical appointments, the end of a self-care, healthcare day, and ending the day at the Botanical Gardens with a cup of tea means everything. Living with a chronic illness, living with mental illness can wear on you. Having multiple appointments every week can get exhausting and it can start to feel like your whole life is about being broken and needing to be fixed. So that's why today I just showed you the moments in between my appointments. How I try to romanticize my life a little bit. Find ways to enjoy life. Did I need to bring a cup and saucer? For, yeah, actually I did. I did. Could I have had my tea in this tumbler? Of course. But no. Did we need to have coffee by the river this morning? We could have just had coffee on the couch in the bathrobe. Done that plenty of times. No. No. I believe that we all need to find moments of beauty in our lives. And if there is pain in your life, whether it's physical pain or emotional pain or trauma, I believe it's even more important. I believe it is a matter of life and death. All right, friends, it's time for next adventure. I'll miss you. Cheers.